What is going on everyone? This is Sarah coming at you from just outside Hartford, Connecticut. And today we're going to be doing one of, if not the quickest trade breakdown we're going to have, at least in baseball, when we look at the CC Sabathia trade, which occurred July 7th, 2008. So at this point, Milwaukee was trying to compete for a World Series. Cleveland was not. Cleveland was decent, but not a World Series com- team. So Milwaukee felt they were an ace away, so they acquired the aforementioned star CC Sabathia from Cleveland in exchange for four players and first baseman La- Matt Laporta, outfielder Michael Brantley, pitcher Zach Johnson, and relief pitcher Rob Bryson. So of course, as always, we start off with the team who acquires the player in the title, and that will be Milwaukee with CC Sabathia. And Sabathia, so he was a free agent after the season. He had a very strong half, second half of the 2008 season before he walked from Milwaukee. Unfortunately for Milwaukee, they were not able to make the World Series, so the trade was for not for them. But did it work out for Cleveland? We're going to start with three players, and we're going to start with Matt Laporta. He spent most of his time in AAA while in the Cleveland system, and he had a little bit of time in the majors, but he only spent parts of like four years in the system before leaving, and he didn't do all that much. Zach Johnson... He played just a little bit over a season and a half before he was gone. Rob Bryson never made the big leagues. Now, the last player is the player who made this trade salvageable for Cleveland, and that's Michael Brantley, the outfielder. Brantley's a three-time All-Star while in Cleveland, and he spent a decade, 10 years in Cleveland. And he was consistently underrated, depending on who you ask. Most people know who Brantley is now because he's in Houston, but when he was in Cleveland, not a lot of people knew who he was. And he had a lot of, you know, he really developed into a high 200s hitter, which is always good. This is the type of guy you want in your leadoff spot. And he he did have a lot of double-digit base stealing and home run potential. Now, he walked, as I said, he went to Houston. And a lot of people were finally taking notice of him at that point. But while in Cleveland, Brentley definitely made his name known. So who wins this trade? Cleveland with a 22.4 war. Michael Brantley single-handedly made this trade worthwhile. Well, Milwaukee still got a respectable 4.9 war out of Spathia. Again, real quick video. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Have a great rest of your day.